what's up guys, thanks for tuning in. Uh, we're here at the 511 booth. Uh, if you've seen any of our reviews before, you know I'm a big 511 fan. And uh, we've got Dave here to tell us a little bit more about some of their new product lines. So Dave, tell me, tell me what's new in the jacket line. So thanks for coming by. I'd love to talk to you about one of our new jackets. This is our new uh, Bristol Parka. Uh, we recently introduced this jacket uh, across the broad line of usage uh, environments from both law enforcement, concealed carry, undercover officers, uh, firefighters if they choose to use it, but really a great concealed carry jacket all the way around. Uh, so it is, you'll see it is parka link, so it's designed to conceal either a full duty belt or a, a, an IWB holster or your concealed carry weapon. Uh, it does have uh, vertical zip pockets here that are waterproof. The jacket com is completely waterproof and fully seam sealed, so wind, rain, no issues whatsoever. Driving rain, no issues whatsoever. It's going to keep you dry and it's going to keep you warm. Uh, it's got the Velcro here on the side as well. Vertical zip storage pockets here again that are both waterproof. Again, for added storage. Every time we, we design a new product at 511, it's all based on end user feedback. People coming to us telling us what they like or don't like about the product that they have. This gives us the ability to put all the features and functions in every product that we make at 511 and bring what they're asking to market uh, right. for them so they can use. Now, uh, does, yep. does it have uh, ID patches or anything like that for law enforcement? It does. Okay. Uh, it's got both two pull-out ID panels on the front, both on the left and the right chest, and it's got one large ID panel on the back. Those ID panels can be embroidered or screen printed with badge uh, or uh, uh, nameplate or whatever you choose to put on them. So you basically you're going from a real covert jacket with the hidden ID panels to a quick identify uh, and be a lot more overt if you're pulling up to a scene or an accident or whatever and you need to ide uh, identify yourself quickly to the people that are at that scene. Great. Now I know with the Parker Link it's a little bit difficult to access a duty belt. You know it's great for covering it up. How do you get access to you know anything that's stored on your belt? Flashlight, handcuffs. Uh, you know, sure. sidearm, anything sure. like that. Great question, and one that 511 uh help develop a new system called our quick zip system it is a patented system that we have here at 511 because again that was the question we kept getting well i've got to take my jacket off i got to unzip it i got to lift it up uh, so what we did on both the left and the right side of the jacket because we don't discriminate against left-handed people uh, we do it both the left and the right side we've got our quick access system so you can quickly access your duty belt what's great about that it zips down it secures back up and i'll show you here on this side once you get that tab secured uh, it's not going to go anywhere. But again, both the left and the right side, it quickly allows you to access whatever you've got on your waist, whether it's your duty belt, your hidden weapon, or whatever the case may be. That's uh, awesome. Again, and it maintains its waterproof of breathability uh, as well. Very cool. Very cool. Now, can you shed layers on it? Absolutely. This is essentially a three-in-one systems jacket. So you can wear it in three different variations and uh, different climates. It does have a zip-in soft shell liner that is water repellent. So uh, when you open this up, you can wear the outer shell by itself. The two combined, that's two. The inner shell, uh, the inner layer by itself as well. So it's a 100% polyester bonded soft shell. It's got a water repellent finish on it. Uh, it does have an additional storage pockets on the inside of the jacket as well. Uh, on both the left side here, you've got a vertical storage pocket here on the chest, uh, as well as the inside shell, additional zippered secure storage pocket here, and on the right side we've got a vertical uh, Velcro closure zip storage pocket on this side. So, yeah, we consistently hear that I need more places to put my gear, I don't want people to know I'm carrying that. Uh, pockets, 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 and when they're on the exterior, we waterproof them. When they're on the interior, we secure them for quick access with the Velcro or more secure access with the zipper. That is awesome. Yeah, it seems like there's a lot of layers to it. And the cool thing about it is, I noticed that with the inner shell, you still have a lot of pockets. Absolutely. With the outer, you have a lot of pockets. When you combine them, I mean, you can carry like, you know, three days worth of food and gear in there. <laughs> you so, could, you so can do it if you had to. It's called the 72 hour backpack. There you go. Jacket. Right. Yeah. yeah. No, but re really cool lineup. And it comes in a variety of colors, I'm sure. You it does. Tundra, black, dark navy, and range red. So, David, I know that you guys are kind of going with a new theme here. Color is a weapon, right? Yep. Tell us a little bit about that. So, recently there's been some research done that showed in an urban tactical environment that there was a lot of opportunity for improving that the way officers were officers and law enforcement, special teams, SWAT, were trying to conceal themselves in an urban tactical environment. Uh, what we found is that the green still worked great, the blacks worked great, but there were things that worked better. One of those things that worked better that we found was the gray. Our new storm gray is part of that introduction of what we're rolling out through here at SHOT Show in a wide variety of products from head to toe solutions from 511. Uh, the gray in itself 
uh, in pieces and parts does great, but when you kit it all up, like you see here that we've got on these mannequins here at Shot, uh, it really it really pops. And again, it's the ideas behind in an urban tactical or other environment that you need this kind of look, you need this kind of conceal. That's what this product's going to do. Uh, so again, from the from the outer carrier, the hard plate carrier, the carrier that we've got, our Rush series of bags, the 12, 24, and 72, the pouch systems that can be applied to any Molly or web platform system, uh, to the all the way to our TDU shirts, our rapid assault shirt, TDU pants, strike pants, and if you haven't tried our new strike pants, it's a great color to try it in. And then even do our new uh, series of boots uh, with the with the series as well in the gray. Uh, so again, from a head to toe solution, you can't when you introduce a new color, you can't just come out with parts and pieces. Right. You got to come up with the whole kit, kit it out like you see here put it all together in one piece and, and again it makes a great appearance and it, and it makes the officer safer in those urban tactical environments. Well this is some awesome gear that you guys have. We're really looking forward to getting a little bit more of it out in the field to test out, put through our own ringer and uh, see how it performs. Super. So thanks so much Dave. Thank I really you. appreciate your time and uh, everything you guys do. you got some really innovative stuff and looking forward to getting a lot more of it. Thank you. Appreciate you coming by. Thank you.